YouTubers, here we go, day number 12. A whole dozen of these videos for you. I wanted to do this outside in my backyard, but you probably already heard about my neighbor and the fuck dog. Let's go inside. So what's that saying? There's more than one way to skin a cat. Well, there's also more than one way to outsmart the dog next door. And whether I'm inside or outside, I'm with you, right? Quick review, 12 videos so far, March Madness. For those of you who might be freshly tuning into me, yes, I made a commitment to do a video on every day in March, and I'm calling it March Madness. Right now, we're in the middle of talking about what I learned at a conference last week in Orlando. And I learned some stuff that makes me really upset with YouTube and Facebook, but you know, what am I gonna do? I'm not as big as they are, but I can maybe outsmart them with a little granny genius. Let's outsmart the robots. I'm using the term robots rather loosely, and really it's artificial intelligence, and I don't understand that shit right now. It turns out that Facebook tries to predict, and YouTube tries to predict what you want to watch, instead of paying attention to what you said you want to watch. So you have to outsmart the predictions. And you do that by engaging. It seems like if you click the button to subscribe, and you click the button to follow, and you click the button to hit notifications, and see first, and all that other stuff that you think is making this stuff of mine, my good stuff, show up in your newsfeed and your notifications, well, guess what? That isn't how it works. The first thing to do is to try to watch the video all the way through. I mean, even if you don't like everything I'm going to say, please watch it all the way through, because that says you really like my stuff. If you make any sort of comment or any take any sort of action on the video, you like it, you share it, you, even if you just put a single word up, that tells them that you like it and you want more of it. And then you know what they do? They have all this information about you. They know where you live. They know maybe how much money you make or don't make. They know how old you are. They know whether you have kids. They probably know what you ate for breakfast, for fuck's sake. So they try to match my content with other people just like you. And you and I know there is nobody else just like you and nobody else just like me. But that's what these crazy artificial intelligence marketing experts are trying to do. I'm getting, I'm getting all frustrated here. We can't have that. Um, so the strategy for this video for today is when you see one of my videos, like it, click to make a comment and share it somehow. Um, on Facebook, that's easy. There's generally a share button. On YouTube, it's a little more complicated. Um, but you can do that and try to send it, of course, to somebody who's going to like it, not someone who's going to get all pissed off about it. We can't have that. We don't want any angry grannies people out there. No, we want people who love their vitamin G, their daily dose of me. Oh, <laughs> shit. I just did it again. I rhymed again. There, there's no, there's no hope for me. There's, a, I've had a bunch of questions and in the next few days, I'm going to answer some of them. Uh, Patreon is one of them. What's that all about? Uh, you can check it out. There's a link in the description. And right now I have five really special co-producers who are supporting me at a level that allows me to say their names right into the camera. Rich Macy, Blair Davis, Mike O'Brien, Octa Productions, and Cal Harrington. They're my heroes right now. And you know, there's people whose names are going to show in the credits at the end of the video. Those are people who are also supporting me at a generous level. And if you want to do that, your names will show up in the credits. I'm back from Orlando, got to do some grocery shopping, got a bunch of errands. And you know me, if it's Tuesday night, I'm probably listening to some friends play music. There's a little more footage from the backyard when I just had all I could take of that fucking dog next door. Woof, 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 woof. I get so fucking tired of that. Nothing I can do about it. And it's so frustrating. But... There is live music, and there is love, and there is the love that I get from you. Every one of you who give me the love, that's what keeps me going. And I'll just sit out in my yard when I don't have to talk on video, and I'll just put earplugs in, and the dog can just go fuck himself. Love you. You know I do. Mwah! Love you, love you, love you. Kisses, kisses, kisses.